My name is Tim Zibir. I'm, I'm a second year PhD student from the Department of Education and Education Engineering. Today, instead of uh, presenting some uh, talk things, I'm going to talk a story. A story about a dog. And how many of you have a dog? Please. Okay. And <coughs> once upon a time, there is a dog whose name is uh, Ibu. He is a male, and his origin is unknown and interesting unknown also. And his strength is also nothing, and he is old. And uh, unfortunately, he's still single. <laughs> so he wants a girl. Uh, as in Japan, most of you know that in Japan there's a well-known uh, site between Japan and Kyubi. Who, who of you uh, know about this site, Japan and Kyubi? Okay, so there is a, in the top in the top world, there is also top Kyubi, top com, top top, and it's it's popular there. And and the the the, the dogs there, the female dogs there are really cute. So this dog, he also want to, even he also want to uh, open an account and upload his photo there. And then, but unfortunately, there is a lot of uh, the male dogs who share their beautiful photos there also, and they uh, a lot of uh, uh, competition. And but Ibu doesn't he is not satisfied with his uh, photos because there is a lot of wrinkles here because he is he's old. So he's made for it. And but fortunately, in our human world, we have uh, some technique to beautify our face. Um, so maybe there is an idea to beautify the, the dog's uh, body also. And do you have some idea about how to uh, modify such a photos? Any of you, please? Any of idea how to beautify the photos in the human world? Yeah. And how can you do that? How can you do that? Uh, what illustrator? Yeah, yeah, illustrator. For example, here, but. And, uh, but Ibu here use another software which is Photoshop and this thing is cool but after he tried the uh, photo filter there which is used by the human being and he found that all the, the wrinkles are still there and sometimes his image is quite blurred, blurred or terrible and also uh, the best he can do is like this so he wants to find some experts online and find some uh, help and so he, he used the google.com.dog and yahoo.com.dog and then he finds that, oh, actually this is a problem of uh, uh, a separation of the structure layer and texture layer. The link wrinkles here is uh, appears as the texture, so there must be some experts and some special techniques which is uh, designed especially for this uh, purpose, to beautify his image before uploading to the .qubit.com.dog. And after searching on the internet, he found a lot of uh, uh, solution and a lot of state of the art, which is designed by the current researchers. For example, here we have the people from Hong Kong, and he built his uh, techniques in 2012, like this, and also some people from uh, Greece and from the U.S. also, and uh, and these techniques is designed especially for beautifying the painting or the natural images. However, after looking more, um, how to say, uh, after knowing better, he found that uh, those techniques have their own problem. For example, the first one caused uh, some artifacts here, and the second one runs slowly, and the third one it has some structure here and it doesn't look real, and the last one is so complicated. So. So, but and all of them are, are far away from Japan. So he he think my life is over. Oh, sorry, this is a mistake here. Yeah, his <laughs> life is over. But fortunately, he he account a m mysterious mathematician. He can do everything. Everything he he can he can to help this dog. Help Ibu. And and then he will ask to 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 see whether there is a method which is uh, simple which can run fast and which is effective compared to the previous method. Uh, and then um, the, the mathematician proposed the structure preserving image smoothing technique why the phase congruence. Actually the mathematician is uh, me and my supervisor. Mm -hmm. so, and so and so the people want him to teach him so let's let's go. Uh, so, 
the, the mathematicians that need to see composed by the two-part phase congruence information and the weighted list square scheme. And oh, it's too hard. How 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 can he how can a dog understand all this? And don't worry, if you the mathematician can teach you. And phase congruence is just something uh, which the which indicate the feature or the feature is an indicator to indicate the um, structure. And which is uh, suitable for our purpose because we want to understand which part is the structure, which part is the texture. And it is actually the congruence of the the um, the similar signals in the, if, if you see the signal side. And yeah, this is the part of the base congruence. And it will becomes more and more understanding about the technique. And and then the mathematician keeps going on to explain what is a weight distance square scheme. And the way this square scheme is actually the to find the curve which can fit the points here, the data points here, if it's painting in the one dimension. And, and if we fit the uh, features here, finally we can uh, update them. We can use the weighted distance squares to do uh, such a purpose. And after one month uh, efforts and study, and it will now became a uh, familiar with this technique and he became a PhD now. Mm -hmm. And oh it's too late for this part, I'm sorry. And and he, he, he then compared the results with the others and found that oh, this result is is uh, better. And in terms of the uh, time consuming it's faster also. So and and when by keeping on he, he found that uh, his technique can and can do even more. For example we can do image abstraction can do the mountain guard half uh, toning uh, abstraction also and enhance the details of the uh, images. So the, um, it, it is the end of the good story. So when he would starts to use the dot qubit dot com dot dog and he will become a computer graphic scientist. So that's the happy end for this story. Okay. And time is up. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> thank you for